Parshat Tazriya, this week's Parsha, opens with the narrative of a woman giving birth and describes the halachot that, ref- that apply after childbirth, including Brit Milah and other halachot. Thinking about this scenario reminds me of the fact that essentially all of the Imahot and many of the Neviot in Tanakh were all akarot, all struggled to have children. And Chazal themselves struggled with the question, why was it that all of the Imahot were akarot, experienced infertility, knowing that it's not genetic, given the fact that they were all from different families? And I'd like to suggest an answer is that the experience of infertility could be very isolating and make, can make someone feel lonely. Not because it should, but because it does. And what the Torah perhaps is trying to highlight is that if a person feels the loneliness of a struggle, they should know that even if there's no community around them, there is a community through history who, ha- who shared that experience. And therefore, one is not as alone as one might think. Of course, this instructs us to try to re- respond to the loneliness of people around us. Often people have struggles and we might not realize the loneliness that they feel in that experience. And just as our historic community could try to address that feeling of loneliness, our community also should always be looking around ourselves at the struggles that different people have and try to think about what it might be for them and how we can help them feel more part of a community and less lonely in their struggles so that they, they will overcome with as much strength and support as possible. Shabbat Shalom.